A clerk shot a man who tried to rob a store overnight. And Saul is live with the story. He's in East Fort Worth this morning. Yeah, in the 5400 block of Ramey Avenue. This is a smoke shop behind me. It is open 24 hours. I spoke with the owner just a little while ago. Now, he tells me that just before 3 o'clock this morning, there was a suspect who came and knocked on the door. He, You know, you have to buzz, uh, you know, to get in. Uh, that gate you see there that is open, that black one with the burglar bars, that is normally closed, and the other white door is open. So he asked the clerk to come in and wanted to play some uh, games. They got some video machines there. Uh, the clerk lets him in. He puts a couple of dollars in the machine, starts playing, and then a short time later, he pulls out a handgun and demands money. The clerk gives him the money, and as he is about to exit the suspect, uh, he cannot get out because, again, that gate is closed, and so the clerk tosses him the keys, but he's fumbling with the keys, doesn't know which one to use, and so at that time, there was another employee who was in the back, came out, saw what was going on, uh, told the guy to stop, and he claims that uh, the suspect uh, pulled out or started reaching for his handgun and that is when the employee shot him several times we are told in the uh, kneecap and the leg and also one of the bullets grazed him uh, in the uh, head uh, but uh, he was taken to the hospital no word on his condition I asked the uh, owner if he knew him or if anybody has seen him and had gone in here before and he says uh, he wasn't sure but that police told him that you know he lives not too far from here I believe to be around 21 years old as for the employee who shot the suspect uh, no word if he will face any charges, uh, but the owner says that he was not arrested. He was simply, you know, protecting the property here. Reporting live in Fort Worth, Saul Garza for Good Day.